Hi there, Shelly. Well, it was really busy here on 93 just about an hour ago near bumper to bumper traffic as people start to make their way north to the ski slopes. But as you said, Fish and Game say with this holiday weekend comes a warning as well. The traffic didn't used to be this heavy. Plenty of traffic and plenty of travelers at the Hooksett area rest stop for President's Day weekend, and ski racks were a common sight. Everyone had anymore? the same idea today. Yeah. So uh, it's a, well, obviously it's a big travel day, but um, it's worth it. It's going to be a lot of great snow up north. The weather's been good. Warmer weather today's obviously helped out, um, kind of get some of the stuff off the road. But hopefully the snow is staying up there for us to go skiing on. Here at Gunstock in Guilford, a popular destination for this holiday weekend, there is plenty of snow. So far this month in February, 40 inches of snow, and the weather is looking to be just beautiful this weekend. It's going to warm up a little bit. Today was just super chalky, beautiful snow. Some people left for the slopes earlier Friday morning to beat the traffic and get to the mountain. It's going awesome. Yeah. Great day out here. Oh, yeah. When did you get here? Got here at about, yeah. I want to say like, 8 o'clock, 9 o'clock this morning. Been skiing all day. It's been great. While conditions are prime for skiers, fish and game officers have a warning for people interested in other winter activities. This past weekend, we had 17 snowmobile slash uh, ATV related events. Um, and that was statewide from the North Country right down to the southern part of the state. And while there has been a lot of snow recently, temperatures will be milder this weekend. So fish and game officers want people to be careful on that ice. Make sure you check it extensively before you go out. Live in Hooksett, I'm Sharice LeClaire, WMUR News 9.